Hello, this reading is for the Cancerian Collective Cancers. For today, Friday, oh, not Friday, <laughs> for today, Saturday, February 10th, 2024, and tomorrow, the Sunday, February 11th. For this weekend, the first weekend of February, let us see what is coming into your collective energy. What messages do I have for you? The full King of Pentacles, Knight of Wands. We will clarify. The full Ten of Cups, Seven of Wands, Six of Wands. The King of Pentacles clarified. Eight of Wands, Page of Pentacles, Seven of Swords. I'm going to put a clarifier on that Seven of Swords. Emperor. Okay. We'll clarify our, our Knight of Wands and then get into it. Our third Seven. So... Well, nothing you can, can't handle with uh, all these issues of the sevens. Sevens of pentacles, the star, and four of pentacles. We'll start with our last energy. So, Cancers, Knight of Wands clarified by seven of, wa seven of swords. Well, we have seven of swords and we do have seven of wands. <laughs> but seven of pentacles is what we're dealing with here. Um, together under the Knight of Wands. So, seven of pentacles the star and the four of pentacles this looks nice cancer what i am seeing here is something that you've hoped for and you've worked on and you've held on to the belief that it would happen is finally happening it does feel like it's happening in the form of this of a person arriving Now, I don't know if this is a job opportunity or if this is a person. I kind of feel it's a person, even though we have all these pentacle energies, only because it's, a, it's like you've invested so much time and effort into this person or this connection. You really wished for it. Anyway, I feel that you're going to get communication from a person who you want to see. They're coming. Message number one. Message number two with our King of Pentacles clarified by. Well, this King of Pentacles is definitely sending you a message, Cancer. The only thing I wanted to, and, and you don't have to wait long for this message to come in. <laughs> Almost wondering if it's relating to this. I mean, you know, within the collective, obviously there's going to be different scenarios of how energy plays out. So if this is a wish for a connection, for instance, and this is continuing, it still is that only this one is coming in. Um, this one is, d is definitely a wish fulfillment. And here it feels like it's more from their side in the fact that they're coming in fast. And, you know, the seven of, pen seven of swords, rather, that does kind of bother me. I have the emperor energy behind that. So this tells me, number one, and as I said, I feel like this is somebody coming to you in this King of Pentacles energy, male or female, does it matter? But it's somebody who's like very, well, they definitely have a strong belief in themselves. Could they be a little egotistical? I feel dogmatic. You know, I'm doing what's right, even if it, you don't understand it doesn't matter as long as I know it's right type of attitude. Anyway, I know this person is coming to you in sneaky energy, but they feel it's justified. They really feel it's justified to come at you in sneaky energy. I don't know why. <laughs> These are short reads, but that's message number two. Somebody is coming in 
I feel this is another um, connection, re uh, emotional, romantic connection. But know that they are coming in with this, you know, I deserve to come and s sneaky, hide my motives, be duplicitous, etc. energy. Don't know why they have to go with such good energy otherwise. You have a little authoritarian type of person coming. <laughs> Cancer. Uh, okay. Um, our last message with the Fool clarified by Ten of Cups. Seven of Wands. As I said, we have so many sevens here. And Six of Wands. You know, part of me could almost see this as you are going out to enjoy yourself and find people who you enjoy being with. But somehow, too, Cancers, I feel that these are people coming towards you in this full energy because they see you as a Ten of Cups. You can provide that emotional fulfillment. They are all happy and, and bouncy very happy and bouncy about to, uh, you know, they're just skipping their way along to you. And maybe with that seven of wands here. And then as I said, we have so many sevens. I feel like this is definitely, people are coming and they definitely are people that have luggage. Maybe not baggage, but they have luggage with them nothing you can't handle from what I see with the cards but know that I feel like somebody is coming to you very very emotionally sure and happy about you they're coming with lots of circumstance and like jauntiness But I feel with all of the energies here, and it continues here, you can be like a little skeptical about it. There's maybe reasons why you're not going to be as gung-ho as the people that are coming at you. Isn't that nice though? So someone is going to be like 100% towards you, and maybe you'll be like 60 or 70% towards them. You will not be the smitten one, Cancer. They will be smitten with you instead. <laughs> All right, that's the message I have for you for the weekend. Uh, yes, definitely three people or three types of energies are coming. They all have their different nuances, but I feel that the common thread is um, they have uh, baggage or luggage associated with them, which I'm sure if this resonates to you, you will um, know what that is. I do hope you have a great weekend. Um, Thank you so much to those of you who have subscribed and liked. I appreciate you. Um, if you are interested in my content and would like more, definitely subscribe. I am going to be coming out with a live for a person on your mind either tomorrow or Monday. So I'll be doing a six card pull on that for people who are around. And until then, I uh, hope you enjoy your time and I'll speak to you later. Bye.